Hi, I'm Gwendolyn with iFixit, and today I'm reassembling an iPad mini GSM. I have a few tips and tricks for you today, but also make sure you refer to our step-by-step -step guide appropriate to your repair when you do your reassembly. Let's get started. First things first, we need to put the headphone jack cable back into the iPad and secure it in place. With the headphone jack cable secured in place, now I can add the front facing camera so I can FaceTime my mom back home. With the camera on, we can add the logic board and secure the lightning connector in place. Logic board is in. Now let's add some speakers so we can hear our tunes. This iPad came with two antennas, the GPS antenna and the Wi-Fi Bluetooth antenna. Let's get those in place. Now we can connect those antennas and several other components to the logic board. Now we can add a few screws to the top right antenna and finish connecting the headphone jack cables to the logic board. The next step is just adding the SIM card, so let's do that. It was so much work to get the battery out, but now it's just as simple as laying it in place. After so many steps, it's starting to come together. Now let's work on the other half, starting with the front panel. And while you're down there, make sure you connect the battery. Those cables are connected. Now let's secure them in place with a bracket. Hope you warmed up your wrist because there's lots of screws to get the LCD shield back in place.
We know you're tired of screws, but there's only four screws left to secure the LCD in place. When you're doing this repair, you can get fingerprints all over your LCD and your front panel. So be sure you clean the front panel and the LCD really well before you place the front panel back in place. You can find all the parts and tools you need for this and many more repairs at ifixit.com. And let us know how it goes. You can find me on Twitter at Gwendolyn Gay and follow ifixit at ifixit. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date on all our latest teardowns and repair videos. And give us a like on Facebook at facebook.com slash ifixit.